going on 48 hours now and police are pounding the pavement a full court press as they try and capture this suspect who is still out there this morning and we really haven't seen a mobilization like this in Queens since jogger Corinna Vetrano was killed a few years ago in Howard Beach this morning as you mentioned that crime reward is now up to $10,000 these posters are being put on all of the area utility poles in this area as people make their way to work this morning telling them about the rape that occurred here and that there is an eligible $10,000 reward for anyone who might know anything. Overnight, we got our first glimpse of who police are looking to speak to. This is the man who was walking in the area right before this attack on Monday morning around 7:30, 7:45. You can see he's wearing a jacket, a hoodie over his head, a red hat, and distinctive red pants. He stops, looks over his shoulder, and checks to see if anyone's watching him, possibly looking to see who his victim might be. This woman, a 52-year-old mother, was chosen at random, according to police. She was thrown down an outside stairwell, attacked, beaten in her face, and then apparently raped, according to investigators. She was knocked unconscious during the horrible ordeal and rushed to the hospital, where she still is recovering this morning after being taken there in critical condition. Of course, people in this neighborhood very much on edge this morning. We have seen detectives canvassing this whole block, speaking with dozens of people to see if they saw anything. Many of them told us they're frightened and are changing the way they move around this neighborhood. I saw the picture this morning quickly. Didn't recognize at all. I mean, it was a little fuzzy picture, but hopefully they find him. And I'm not on my phone. You know, sometimes people are walking, looking at their phones, not paying attention. So um, I've been very cautious about that. We just pray for this woman and send our love and our regard and our praise to her. And a live look here the mobilization effort on 72nd Road and Casino Boulevard. Members of the Community Affairs Bureau, the detectives, and also officers who are out again using good old-fashioned shoe leather trying to get this suspect behind bars if anyone knows anything. Again, there is that $10,000 reward that's being offered this morning for any information leading to an arrest of this suspect. Crime Stoppers number is 1-800-577-TIPS.